Okay. I mean, I think this is going to be a rebuilding year, so I'm not expecting too much from the season. But who knows? Maybe we can make a miracle happen. That isn't the greatest start. Five field goals. Five field goals, and we lost by one point. That was not awesome. I didn't like that game. Let's not do that again. We can score touchdowns? Hey, guys, we figured out how to... We, we can score touchdowns now. I fig we figured it out. Against the charge. Oh, hey, that makes a little more sense. But still, I'll take it. I'll take that any day. Take 27 points. That's a pretty solid score. And we got a win. I'll take that any day. Any day. Hey, guys. I miss points. You guys miss points? I miss it when we scored some points and won games. Hey, I remember that score. I remember that score. We had that score last week. But this week, we're on the winning side, so it feels a lot better. Oh, okay. if we could keep doing this, I'd love that. Let's keep doing this. Okay, so we lost, yes. But if this pattern continues, that means next week we should win against the Ravens. And then we'll get a win. Because that's, that's the weird pattern. It's like the Miami pattern last year. It's a developing pattern, so we should win next week, right? Wait. Uh, hang on, um, that looks like the same score, and it's still the same teams, we still lost. I, I thought we were supposed to have a different game this week. I thought the script changed this week to us winning, barely. Not by us losing, barely. And by barely, I mean touchdown. Hmm, I don't like this script. Okay, well, it's the bye week. We're last in the division, so that's not good. But maybe we can turn it around? Probably not. But maybe we can. I don't know. Maybe. What? The Mayo Man? He played good? How, why, why hasn't he been starting? He should have been starting the whole year. Why have we waited until week eight? When Tannehill is hurt, he should have been starting since week one. I don't... I don't want to see anyone else starting this year. Okay, so that wasn't the best game, but that maybe that was just a fluke game. I'm sure. Next week, we'll play worse. We'll play worse. That was a awful game. I I don't even care. That's how bad it is. Great, it doesn't even deserve correct grammar. That's how bad. Oh, we lost? Really? Against the Jaguars? Whoa, I'm so surprised. This season's getting depressing. Can we just have a win, please? Hey, a win's a win. I'll take a win. I don't care if it's the worst team in the NFL. A win is a win. Okay, that was one of the best Titans game I've seen all year. But, come on. Two block punts? And we lose? <sighs> there was so many penalties, too. There were so many penalties against us. So many stupid penalties that could have helped us win. And a stupid missed field goal. Oh, I wish this Titans team was better. Wow, shocker. We're down two touchdowns with four and a half minutes to go. I wonder how this game's gonna go. Can't hold on the ball to save our life. Wow, this isn't gonna end well. Wait, what? We won? We won. 28 to 27. There were four and a half minutes just a little while ago. We were down 14 points. We made a 14 point comeback? How? Oh, Mr. Mayo, man. Thank you. And you have two defense. You played amazing in that last four and a half minutes. We made a comeback. That was a great game. And look, we can still make the play awful. We'll play awful again and lose to Case Keenum. There goes our playoff hopes. Wow, I am so happy to be a Titans fan. Well, you know, at this point, I'm ready for next season. I'm ready to get the season over with. Maybe we have an entertaining game, finish off the year, but I'm, I'm ready for next year. Hopefully, Mayo Man can be better. You know, when I said I was ready for next season, I wasn't kidding when I meant I wanted to still try. I didn't want to just give up and die. 
Our team did realize that, right? I know Ryan Tannehill's out there. It's not Mr. Mayo Man. But can we at least try? Okay, Mr. Mike Vrabel. I think you want to win next week. It's Tannehill and Henry's likely their last season here. And Mike Vrabel looks ready to get one final win with them next week. We'll see. So, you remember this position? We were here last year, except on the other side. The Jaguars made a huge comeback, and we had fallen apart, and they took our spot in the playoffs. But this year, this year we have a chance to knock them out of the playoffs. Get revenge for last year. We can do this. If we win, we don't make the playoffs, but neither do they. And if we can't make the playoffs, Neither can the Jaguars. We won. The Jaguars are out of the playoffs. They will not be attending. We got our revenge, guys. We got our revenge. And Tana Tannehill, Derrick Henry, that was an amazing last game. I'll miss you, Henry, especially. And you too, Ryan. We had a great few years together. Hope you have a great next year, too. What? fired Mike Brabel. Why? Why would we fire Mike Brabel? He was doing fine. We were about to see them work together. I was so excited to see Mailman and Brabel work together. I I thought they were a match perfect. How, why did we fire him? There was no reason to. I guess we got Brian Callahan. Looks like some young offensive-minded coach. Shocker. But hey, I'm a Titans fan. I'm ready for next season. Next year, next year hopefully it will be different. We'll get a lot more wins, and maybe we can make the playoffs. Who knows?